Well, thank you. I thought you were going to... See? I, they don't, maybe, I, maybe I shouldn't be talking here at all. Well, welcome, everyone, and thank you for all showing up here today. Uh, this is truly a, a very momentous occasion for the city of Sturgeon Bay. Um, I kind of look at this as another major event in our relationship with the Coast Guard. Uh, I don't know, five, six, seven years ago. John, what was it? When did we start this Coast Guard city? It's been a while, huh? Um, a lot of work went into it, and uh, this is one of the things, one of the many things that have come out of it. Uh, we were able to uh, uh, find this boat. Uh, there was, I, we have connections, so uh, we got wind of it and said we have a place for it. Uh, of course, they didn't like my idea. I wanted to keep it in the water and give tours, but you know, I didn't get my way. But uh, but we got the boat. That's the main thing. So, uh, and I don't want to take up too much time, but I do want to once again thank everyone for coming out today. This is, like I said, a very uh, momentous occasion for the city of Sturgeon Bay, and this is truly going to be a very uh, worthwhile and uh, uh, huge addition to the city, of, no doubt about it. So, Bob? Uh, for the Coast Guard's birthday each year, and uh, today, uh, because of this particular ceremony, uh, the governor has passed along uh, that opportunity uh, to our mayor. So he's actually the governor, at least for the next few minutes, I think. So uh, that's pretty cool. Um, if I could get... Uh, Commander Tasikas, Lieutenant Commander Godwin, Lieutenant Commander Frizee, and uh, Senior Chief Sen to join us up here at the front along with the Chief. If I get my head between here and that speaker, it stops. So I, I, that means my head is really dense. <laughs> there we go. We got everybody up here. A proclamation. Whereas the U.S. Coast Guard began as the Revenue Cutter Service on August 4, 1790, under the Department of Treasury, and whereas in the wake of the terrorist attack on September 11, 2001, the Coast Guard was transferred by President George W. Bush to the Department of Homeland Security, serving as the nation's frontline agency for enforcing our laws at sea, protecting the marine environment and our vast coastline and ports and saving lives and whereas Coast Guard Sector Lake Michigan headquartered in Milwaukee is comprised of 21 Coast Guard stations that are responsible for 1,638 miles of shoreline and approximately 19,000 square miles of surface water in and along four states and whereas Coast Guard units in Wisconsin include stations in Milwaukee, Kenosha, Sheboygan, Two Rivers, Green Bay, Sturgeon Bay, Washington Island, Bayfield, and Marine Safety Detachment at Sturgeon Bay, and whereas Sector Lake Michigan's missions are accomplished by a dedicated workforce of 541 active duty, 208 reserve, and 16 civilian personnel with 51 boats, plus 14 ice skiffs and an airboat, and whereas the all-volunteer Coast Guard Auxiliary 9th Western Region supports Sector Lake Mission Michigan by performing a wide variety of operational, educational, support and training missions with 1,200 personnel throughout the region. Now, therefore, I, Scott Walker, Governor of the State of Wisconsin, do hereby proclaim Tuesday, August 4, 2015 as Coast Guard Day throughout the State of Wisconsin, and I commend this observ observation to all citizens. <laughs> 